Hello, beautiful humans of the internet. It is I, Caitlin, back for another thrift haul. Also accompanied by... Nope, my dog. So this is a cumulative haul. This is called, I cleaned out my truck. So this is from Savers, Goodwill, Nordstrom Rack, Clothes Mentor, and Turnstile. So for Nordstrom, it was during Clear the Rack, I believe. For Clothes Mentor, it was 70% off clearance. Turnstile, it was 75% off red tags. And Savers, they usually have a 25% off coupon. I think some stuff was from the 50% off. So let's just dive in because it's going to be a haul. <laughs> Uh, everything still has tags on it. I'm gonna try to kind of take tags off as I go along because then it's easier for me in the cleanup realm. Here we have a kind of like a turtleneck, I guess, maybe. Long sleeve it is Lululemon. Free people. It's a medium large, like a jacket, rain crunch, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, so this is from Clothes Mentor. Is it annoying if I take the tags off during it? I hope not. We have a Swiftly V-neck from Lemon. This is more, no, just kidding. Ignore that. Maeve, my anthropology. It's just a fun dress. This I need to return because I paid full price for it. So, I hope I still have the receipt from that trip. I thought it was part of their sale, but it wasn't. It's a really cute aloe pullover and it's doing with tags, but I paid 15 so. Lululemon crops. These were $9. There was some more Lululemon. I might get it if their sale gets like more discounted. Another pair of lemon. The other pair of lemon. One September, I think this is their old label, but it's new with tags from Anthropology. It's just a lightweight top. Good, I just saw the How many days do I have to return it? Seven, maybe, seven. Which means I need to return it like tomorrow. Two more things in this bag. This is a nice find. I'm sure by the print you can tell what it is. Lily Pulitzer fluorescent, but it is new with tags. And Kate Spade Saturday new with tags like some stuff on the back it's just a structured black dress so that's everything from clothes mentor now to turnstile this is my favorite sale of the year for them i will go back i've gotten some stuff at the 50 percent off before i try to wait till the 75 percent off and then a lot of times too they have okay my dog has its kong so wait if you're gonna use the kong go over here over there lay down 
Louie. Lay down. Good boy. I don't need peanut butter getting on things. And then they also, afterwards, I think maybe next week, they mark all their red tags down to $2. So a lot of the jeans I want to get when they're down to $2. Um, just because, like, the designer ones are $51. And I still can't justify spending that much. It's, what, $13 or something? So I did really well. I don't know. So I think for everything I'm going to show you from here until I say done was, like, $110. Aviva tank. One, I don't even know where the red tag is. What the heck? I don't know. But it's an Aviva. It's like one of their wrap. Oh, here's the tag. It's like a wrap style. long sleeve an Apoletta I believe this is one of their newer labels the basic lightweight top I don't want to keep going into that. This is another one of those. Is this a Viva or Lululemon? It's a Viva. Another one of those wrap long sleeves. I never go in their kids section, but I wanted to because it was a, and I found some good things. I also found this there. It's definitely not kids. A really old school swiftly or not swiftly um i wonder if it had something on i don't know um it's a scuba hoodie and it says special edition and then on the back it has like the remnants of so i wonder if that was like once on there or i didn't see that we'll have to look into that So you get these things and made well, just a pair of basic black pants. I've never tried these before, but the price was right. They're Eileen Fisher jeans. They have raw hem. Stella McCartney by Adidas. Make the blue something better. Um, long sleeve. Sorry, my dog's right behind me, so that's why I'm looking back. A very basic Madewell tee. I hate plastic bags. This is cool. I really like this. It has a lot of marks on the arms, which is weird because it looks new without tags. So it is a blazer. I don't think it's leather or anything like that. Oh, frick. Okay, well that stinks. Oh, it is leather. So I just open it up and there's a huge stain. So, I'm still going to sell it. They say I'll disclose the stain and everything in it, but it's beautiful. I mean, no one sees the inside. And with it being real leather, hopefully someone still wants it. That's a bummer. Sure, you can guess what this is. <laughs> uh, Lululemon Power Y tank. They had a couple of Lululemon tops. Um, again, maybe if they go to $2, I'll get the other ones, but 
this was a good find. This was marked at something and then down to 12, like 25 and then 75% off that. So it is a, and they, it's marked as Lululemon. So someone must not have bought it, but it's just a sweater. I don't know if I should have gotten this, but I like it. So I got it. It is Dolan Left Coast Collection, which is often sold at Anthropology. I just liked it. I really liked this. I hope this doesn't have anything on it. I don't think this is real leather, though. Yeah. This is a vegan leather jacket. It is from Hey Hey at Anthropology. I think these are going to do good. They are aloe. Yeah, everything I purchased from Turnstile was 75% off. I didn't purchase anything. I kind of told that to myself. Going in, I was like, you're not buying anything that's not red tag. The Clover Canyon. This will just go to thread up. It's pretty. Some more clothing pieces. Rebecca Minkoff. Little pearl button sweater. Another lemon power Y tank. So I got three pairs of shoes. One I was excited about because I saw it when I've been in there before shopping for myself. And so I was excited to see they were red tag and they were still there. Um, so these are the ones I was excited about. I've only found them one other time when I was out in Colorado. Can you guess what they are? Maybe a couple seconds. They are all birds, if you can see that. Um, yeah, so I was super excited. Great, now my dog has his bone, so sorry for that. You can see him right there. Very excited to see these. Yeah, there's some shoes too I wanna go back for once they're $2. We have Cole Han. I think I've sold these in black before. And then these, I think I paid 23 for, but I think they'll do really well. They are fry. They didn't have a tag on the bottom, so I asked, um, and they had said, because they were 90 with 75% off. Um, but they're a good size, they're size eight. I don't know the style name, um, but I really like them. If they were my size, they probably, oh. Oh, so when they're really expensive, they keep one pair in the whatever back. So yeah, 95. So the one that was in the back was tagged. So that was from Turnstile. We'll do some. I have a couple of Nordstrom rack bags. I haven't looked in these in a while. And hopefully if there's stuff I don't want in them anymore, the 90 days hasn't them up or 60 days I think it is now we have current Elliott shorts these were it looks like 1462 so I will be selling these I think I got this one for me yeah this is three people yeah, I got this for me. And apparently that was it in there. Okay, when was this from? 12.22. Sweet, so I would still be able to return things. Made well. This is one thing I might return. 12.97. Yeah, it's only $12, but... 
it's not really something I'm super excited about. These were 23. I think they'll do well. They're a size 32. The first time ever finding this. I'm not even going to pronounce it. They are the Danica Wide Leg Pants. I think for some of my Nordstrom Rack things, I want to put on Poshmark uh, my cost of goods on there so my husband can see that I spent a little bit more for them. This is one I think I'm going to return. Yeah. So it's Walter Baker. It's like this I one sleeve. I liked it. I was hoping actually it would ring up a little bit less, but so that'll be returned. Rag and bone jeans. I will sell these. They're just the low rise shorts. Okay, 20. So it's 13.49. Basically, if I would buy it at a thrift store for that price, it or not keep it but I will keep it to sell and then lastly what are you um apparently this is super expensive PSWL Perwenza Schuler um but I think it's missing the belt and it just doesn't excite me so those are gonna go back See what's in this last bag. So it's twelve twenty nine. So yes, I would still be able to return this stuff too if I wanted. This was a really good find. It's rails. It was only nine eighty eight. It is a. I don't know. Is it a, oh, it's a dress. It's just a wrap dress. I'm gonna return this just because I already have one and I haven't listed it yet. It's the great. Um, it was $17.99, but I haven't even listed my other one yet. So, so with the discount, it was what $15.07, I think $15.74. Who knows? Because this was during Clear the Rack. This one, I guess. Um, Rag and Bone size large. Is this one I was going to try to wear? Maybe? I don't know. I think I was going to try to try this on. So we'll do that. This I liked. It is Joie. I paid $16.49. So 13 I think. I don't know. Just a long sleeve. Button up, button down. This I think I was gonna, oh shh, tacky fried chicken, I can't. Final sale, non-returnable. Oh, well, I guess I'm stuck with it. <laughs> so, it cost me like 15 bucks, it's ALC. Well, whatever. So that stuff will go back as well. Now the rest is Savers or Goodwill or Salvation Army. The regular thrift stores that I go to. Citizens of Humanity. I don't really pick this um, up anymore, but they were distressed in the really liked them, and I think this was half off day. Yeah, I think this was half off day. I thought this was cute. It's just made well. Say moi. 
This is from 2016. Whew, slog sleeve striped. Usually I don't pick up free people to sell anymore, but this was very unique. So it is just like a across the shoulder one, but like, look at these sleeves. That is one sleeve. Vineyard Vines, button up, plaid shirt. I've gotten more selective with Madewell too. I personally love Madewell. This was really cute. I think it's, no, it doesn't feel silk. Where are you, material tag? Oh, cotton and silk. But it's just pretty. I like the print. Patagonia. Button up. Or snap. Snap up. Flannel. This is super pretty. Tibby. I don't really find Tibby anymore. This will probably go to thread up. The tag is all folded up, but it is Athleta. It's just an open cardigan. It must have been half off. Otherwise, I don't really buy Athleta anymore. Yeah, it's half off. I don't know really why I bought these, but they're what, size 2 regular? They're just Lululemon pants. They were only 6 bucks, so. And this was behind the counter at Salvation Army, and I was like, eh, I just want to see it. And I was right. Lululemon men's shorts. I liked this find. Alice and Olivia. Except I'll probably send this in a thread up because it hasn't been doing as well on my Poshmark. But it is new with tags. Only found this brand once before at my thrift store. I'm excited again. It's Faithful. Or, where's the inner tag? Um, Faithful the brand. Sometimes it'll say one or the other. It's just a really cute, lightweight top. I say cute a lot. Sorry, not sorry. These, I believe, are new without tags because they have, like, the button attached in, and I don't know, like, the extra button. I don't know if anyone who would wear it with the extra button in there. They are Everlane. It's pink work pants, dress pants, whatever you want to call it. This I looked up because I was like, well, I really like it. It seems very bohemian-esque. So it is the Jet Set Diaries. And it looks good. So it is like this. So it's a maxi. It's gorgeous. I will be sending this in somewhere. Current Elliot, some basic pants. This Salvation Army trip was good. This was, I think, all from, yeah, from one trip. So I went into the youth section, which I like rarely ever look in at Salvation Army. Oh my gosh, okay, whatever, I'll get that on. I found a lot of Aviva. So is this Aviva? It's kind of like the cool eraser back. This was only $2.99. Another one, also $2.99. That's the Aviva. These 
These are also Aviva. These were only $3.99. These were in with the youth. They are actually Lululemon. They are just a size two, so they're tiny. Yeah, those were three three ninety nine. These were four ninety nine. Also, again, Aviva. These are reversible. Got a pair of Lululemon. These are like the Run Inspire crops. But it's falling asleep. This is great. Picked up a pair of AG. Again, I don't really pick it up anymore, but it's the AG denim, which I know does good. And they have a really fun raw hem. Okay, I gotta adjust. I'm pregnant, so that's what that whole get up was. And a pair of Patagonia jeans. This is probably my favorite find from that adventure. Is a I kind of like felt it and I was like that feels good. And it is Lululemon. Got two more bags left people. This was one of those things I think I spoke into existence. You know, when you like repeat a brand in your head when you're at the thrift store, you're like, I want to find this. I want to find this. Then I found it. It is equipment, silk blouse. I think that's kind of what they're known for is their silk blouses. At first I thought this was Wild Fox. Um, usually I don't pick up chaser but it was inexpensive and I loved it says I heart my rescue and um, this person really did because now that I'm looking at it there's dog hair everywhere everywhere so that will be going right in the wash that's funny because my dog has not seen these yet they've been in my trunk made well now this is a little bit different because of the sleeves. A little bit bigger. This was a fun one. I rarely find this brand in my thrift stores. It is Reformation. It's just very basic. Um, and it's not like a bodysuit or anything. So I don't know what the point is of that little front part, but for whoever buys it to, you know. This was only $3.99, that's why I got it. I don't think it was supposed to be priced $3.99. And uh, it is Tahari, it's new with tags. So it was originally $188. This will just go to thread up. But it's a nice dress. I'm getting selective about my little lemon tanks I pick up. This one wasn't expensive though. You know how you can like feel quality too when you're going through things? Like this was in with the long sleeve knits. And I was like, I feel like I've seen this material before. And so it's this. And it's Lululemon. I've never seen this kind of style of Lululemon before. That was pretty cool. I do still pick up a lot of the leggings if I find them at my thrift store because they're usually priced around like 12 to 15 with a discount. I can usually still obviously make a profit. These uh, I think are the like original speed tights. They're in really good condition. These are fun. Thank you, 
guess what brand these are. Literally like shorts and then mesh. They are aloe yoga. Aloe yoga is probably like my second favorite athletic brand to sell. This I think I got because it was super inexpensive. Which I need to like stop doing because I have a bunch of stuff to list. But it is Athleta. It's like a open hoodie type situation. It is from fall 2016. Oh, that's weird. Okay, just kidding. These are also from, these are from an old trip to Turnstile Consignment when they were just doing 50% off. So these were $7, made well jeans, originally from Turnstile. These I got, they weren't half off, but they were marked at $9.50 as like no brand. Um, there's a brand right there. I've actually owned these leggings before. They're size six, so they're blue lemon leggings. This one I was excited to find because I've never had, I've never found this brand before. Um, so this I paid $9 for again from that turnstile consignment. They are one teaspoon jeans. I was excited because yes, I've never found one teaspoon before. So last bag. This is another brand I was excited about because I rarely find it in my thrift store frame. Just a pair of black, just super distressed Rahem pants. Madewell sweater, like balloon sleeves. Usually they mark up their Patagonia, so I was surprised to see that this wasn't marked up. It's hard to show with the, but it's just a dress, strappy back. I don't know where the, oh, there it is, Patagonia. Um, this is probably me being naive. It's only five bucks plus whatever discount. I didn't realize Fry made clothes too. So it's just a button up flannel. Thought I'd give it a go. I really like this brand. The jackets and stuff do well. So I figured might as well test out a dress. It's Arcteryx. The logo looks like a creepy little skeleton man. It's just a athletic dress. Oh my gosh, my foot's falling asleep again. <laughs> okay. We're almost there. 40 minutes later. It's a pair of Athleta leggings. I was excited about. I never go down this one aisle of dresses and I went down at this time and I'm glad I did. However, I am going to have to disclose a pretty significant flaw. So it's a size 8 Lululemon dress. I've only found um, two other Lululemon dresses, one in Colorado and one um, in a Goodwill, I think, near me. So there is some pretty, it looks like someone maybe wore a badge. I don't even know if it's going to pick up on camera. Um, I might try to, oh, there you go. You can see the, I might try to deep hill it. Otherwise, I'm just going to sell as is. Oh, my dog just licked that. That's why. It's wet. Louie, no. A Lululemon Swiftly tea. 
this I was surprised to only see marked at $7.99 because it still has the rip tag in it. Usually if it still has the rip tag, they price it up. It is a Lululemon zip up. I don't know if this is one that has the, yeah. So it has the letters around it on the size dot, so I'll be able to look up a style name pretty easily. These were in with the women's, so I was kind of unsure why, but I'll take it. They are men's little lemon shorts. Wherever the logo is on these. Sometimes if it's this logo, then it's men's. Okay, I promise we're almost done. Oh, these are the three things I got today. So again, I went and looked in the children's. This is at that Salvation Army that I found a lot of good stuff at. Uh, they didn't have any more Aviva, but they did have this pair of Lululemon pants. Again, they were only $3.99 because they were there. Uh, this was very interesting to me. It is Ivory Ella. It's like a tracksuit. It is new with tags. So that was interesting. My piles are falling down on me. This was in the kids section too, so that was weird. They are rag and bone, they are black pants. And then two more things. This is from a Goodwill near me. Here's the, yeah, my dog's gonna be sniffing around on it. Okay, I don't know why I'm messing with this price tag right now. Let me move. These are Tory Birch flip-flops and this is only $1.99 is a Kate Spade little coin pouch spend it all in one place ka -ching. so that is it I say that is it but like that was a lot thank you so much for <laughs> so many Put cramps. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Now I have to put all of this away. So stay tuned for next time. <laughs> Bye.